Hmm. I think I'll use vices to push on my eggs. One mounted long ways on the left and sideways on the right. The vice pushes on the egg and the egg pushes back equally hard. The forces balance. But as I turn the vices, they push the eggs harder and harder. Soon, the right-hand vice pushes so hard that the egg can't match it and it smashes. But look at the egg mounted long ways. It can push back much more. It takes a lot more force before the egg smashes completely. It's funny to think of something like an egg being able to push as much as a human hand. It's not only eggs that push back. See these books on the table? Don't look like they're doing much. But the weight of the books is pushing down on the table. And that's not all. The table's also pushing back on the books. Imagine what would happen if it didn't. Even these comfy cushions can push back on me. Watch what happens as I sit down. Let's look at that again. At first, my weight is a bigger force than the upward force of the cushion springs, so I go down. But the more squash the springs get, the more they push back. Eventually, the force pushing back equals my weight. The forces in each direction balance, and I stay put. It's called equilibrium.